is uh, fairly sizable. Here's the question. Why? Why do you think he has taken this course? I'll start with you, Alan. Um, it's a very good question, and it will be answered in time. Mm -hmm. In our history, we, we felt that something good happened between the momentum that he had in the election process. He had all these contributions to the internet, they were talking about it. And uh, at a certain point, he took the private option over the public option, which was a significant, very significant at the time, but few people noticed it. And we uh, recognized because he did have that momentum over McCain, uh, that Wall Street the pharmaceuticals, the computer companies, it was easy to get behind the winner. And they put the money in and they offered him the money and he took it. Now that is the question. Why and what, what happened behind the scenes? Perhaps some of you know. I don't, I don't know all the details. But when you take that kind of money, your, your principles may be heavily compromised. If something happened because none of the things he promised, uh, the transparency, uh, a government that would be uh, reconsider the war on terror and these programs, none of that happened. None of it. And in his choice of advisors early on, it was very clear right away when he picked Hillary Clinton that, and Robert Gates, who is a criminal, basically, who's in, been in government since 1980. And I, I don't use that word lightly. I, I, considering what he did with Casey in Iran Contra, a lot of people know the story on, on Gates. I mean, amazing that Gates reemerged as a moderate in this so called administration. And his choice of his economic advisors, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. On everything he backed out, like Jeremy said, the man stunned us with his lack of spine. It, it's unbelievable. A weak, a weak man. I was stunned. I, and I knew him uh, from when he was running, and he was so passionate and strong in his condemnation of, of, of this way of life. He sensed art, he, he, he sensed his liberal base, and he had completely abandoned it. Except for the Democrats that Jeremy talks about. I don't know those people, they don't talk to me, but obviously, uh, you know, I know what you're talking about. The Bill Maher, yeah. MSNBC stuff. I don't get booked on uh, MSNBC anymore, I don't know. Uh, so, uh, what Bill, happened? Bill Maher what is happened? looking for you any week. Well, yeah, but Bill is, you know, as Jeremy is saying, Bill believes in drones, you know. He says uh, drones are better than boots on the ground, which I don't agree with at all. I don't, why interfere in the first place, you know? So, 